So we're going to turn right to begin with from the town centre towards Burger King on the A339. Just on the right as I freeze the frame you will see that we need the right hand lane to go A339 south. Have the traffic lights changed, checking the mirror, slowing it down. We're going to speed up the traffic. The markings here have changed as of the 13th of July 2020. What we're going to do now is keep that right signal on and aim for the right hand lane. In a minute I'm going to freeze the frame again and there'll be a sign on the left distinctly saying that you can only use the left lane here to go towards Mill Lane and the store. So we need to stay in this lane. I'm then going to cancel the signal and keep the left edge of my car up against that line, checking the left mirror and the left blind spot. And if it's safe, we're moving over to that lane, then we can cancel the signal and continue on down the road. We could stay in the right hand lane, but then we'd need to move back unless we were turning right. Turning right from Burger King to Mill Lane and the police station. As you approach a roundabout in a normal way, move into the right hand lane safely, checking your mirrors, signalling, quick blind spot check. The sign up there says we're going to the industrial areas in Hambridge Lane on the right. Check your main mirror in case the lights change and be ready to stop if it was safe to do so. Soon enough we will need the new lane on the right. The new lane you will need again to check your main and right mirror, signal right and then move safely into that lane where that lorry and that silver car are going. Keep up against the curve. Just speeding up the traffic. As we go on to the roundabout, it's okay now for that signal to cancel because round the corner, this lane is gonna to split to two and we want the left of the two. So we wanna keep that left headlight on the end of my bonnet in line with those lines on the left. So without the signal on, you just keep to those lines because if you signaled right, you'd look like you want the right lane. That could cause someone behind to wait. With the left signal on, we go down towards Mill Lane, look round the corner, there's a red light in front of the Camp Hobson lorry. So as you can see, there are traffic lights everywhere near this roundabout. There's a 20 speed limit, and round the corner, you're entering a one-way street. Check the side mirrors for bikes and anything that might be passing you, and continue down the road. Turning right from Sainsbury's towards A339 North, that's the Robin Hood. As you go past Sainsbury's, it's best to keep in the right-hand lane. The roundabout has changed. The left lane, where the red car is, only goes towards Burger King A339 South. The right lane that we're in, you have three options, and there will be a sign on the left, which you can see now. You can go left towards the station. You can also go ahead in both lanes to turn right up towards Robin Hood and the M4, A339 North. So of those three lanes, we want the middle one because we don't want to end up in the right lane of the dual carriageway on the new road. Keep checking your main mirror as you go around. Keep to that left lane. Again, we're not signalling right because if we're signalling right, we would look like we want to change lanes. So don't signal. As you move off, check your mirrors again. Continue staying in the left lane. And this way, you're always in the normal driving position. The largest change to the Sainsbury's roundabout has been where there is no longer a right turn in towards the town. So to go to the station now, you need to move into the right hand lane and follow the road ahead because you can't turn right using the right lane. You would normally keep to the left lane, the normal driving position, as you would go straight ahead. But on this roundabout, because we know we're turning right into the new road after the roundabout, that's why we're using the right lane. It's written on the floor, A339, both lanes, as you can see. And again, we're using this lane shortly afterwards for turning right. Always check your main mirror as you come up to lights and always know what's behind you in case you need to stop. Remembering that amber means stop. Check your main and right mirror, signaling right, and moving into this new filter lane. As we're waiting, keep an eye on what's behind you. Traffic lights can change. I'm putting the rear camera up in the top right hand corner so you can see that there is a car very close to me. Amber means stop if you can stop before the line without causing an accident. Now I might be going very slowly but I have less than half a car length to the line and this changes to amber so therefore it would not be safe to slam on the brakes because the red car might drive in the back of me. The red car stopped directly. 20 speed limit in the new road and that's it. Thanks for watching, 
I hope it's been helpful. For more information about what we do, find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash ultimate driving. If you'd like more information and other videos, please look at our website, ultimatedriving.net. Thanks again. Hope to see you soon.